This is how you remove the warning label from your gas tank. Make sure you have a fingernail. That's pretty much all the tools you need. You need a rag, a little bit of WD-40, a little bit at a time, just pick away at it. Get rid of these ugly things. Clean it up nice. Just takes a couple of minutes. And you'll have a beautiful gas tank. A beautiful gas tank. This is my new bike. I always wanted to get rid of these things, and now I'm doing it. They are uglier than sin. If you're riding a bike and you don't need, know that you need a helmet, you shouldn't be riding the thing. Unless, of course, you live in a state where you don't need it, but that's your choice. But like I said, the only tool you need here is your fingernail. Quite simple. This takes a little time and patience. Doesn't destroy your tank. That's my dog barking at the helicopter. Perfect day outside for this. Just about halfway there. It's only taken a couple of minutes. This is my new Yamaha 2008 V Star. It's a cruiser. I sold my crotch rocket because it was too fast, and I'm getting too old for that crap. So I need something a little slower. A little slower, a little more comfortable. Take some nice long rides with my wife. She loves to ride. She's brand new at it. I gave her my old bike. <sighs> this is a little boring, but that's okay. Sometimes they say, it's the journey, not the destination, that's important. This is not one of the cases of that. But that's okay. You'll be glad that you took the time to do this. Ow! Don't use that finger. Use your thumb. getting there. About three quarters done. Be patient. Guess which hands here. There we go. 
kit in there. Okay, I'm gonna switch back. Little patience goes a long way. It's important in life. Not a lot of people know that. Pretty simple it sounds, but people are not patient. With stickers on motorcycles and just about everything else in life. People are not patient. Alright, almost there. We'll get this done. <clears throat> Spray a little WD-40 on there. That should be it. Clean it up pretty nice. Maybe I'll take a little soap and water after I put WD-40 on there. I don't think it will, but I don't know for sure if that'll harm the finish. I doubt it will, but better safe than sorry. Take a little soap and water and clean it off. That'll be it. Now I'll have a nice tank. A couple little pieces here. Little chunks I want to get. Eh, that should be good. Alright, let's see how we do I believe they should let this sit for about 30 seconds. Uh, let me get the bike up straight here, a little straighter. Whoops, probably gonna, probably gonna drip a little bit. My rag down there. <coughs> probably let this sit for about 30 seconds. Let it soak in. Ah, catching drips down here, don't want it going all over. All right, 30 seconds. That's not a long time. But 30 seconds can also be an eternity, depending on what you're waiting for. Okay, 30 seconds, counting down. I'm not keeping official time, so we'll see how close I am. 30 seconds, we're getting there. So this is my new beautiful bike. I love it. Just got it yesterday. Can't wait to take a nice ride on it. Summertime. It's beautiful out. I love this thing. Take a nice long ride on it. It's all shiny and stuff. Lots of chrome that I'm gonna have to keep clean. Ugh. Whatever. All right, let's give it a shot here. Start rubbing. Now this will take a little patience too, apparently. Gotta rub away at it. Get this stuff off of here. <coughs> you can see it's pretty good solvent, that WD-40. It eats up that, uh, that adhesive. It's pretty strong adhesive. But you just keep rubbing. It'll get it there. Oh, gonna spray a little bit more. See what happens. Yep, cleaning up pretty nice. It's getting there. For another little bit. Let it soak in, eat away at it. Like I said, I'll clean the tank up, a little soap and water mixture, make sure it doesn't get nasty. That WD 40, I don't think it'll harm it, but like I said, I don't want to take a chance. My new baby here.
take away a little bit more at this. Cut a, cut a couple of stubborn ones here. Don't want to come off. Always stubborn stuff in life. A little bit more WD-40. Let that set just for a second. Or two. Or three. Or ten. There we go. Alright, there we know. Go, not not too bad. Just a little bit of a square thing here. Maybe I'll come back and clean that up another day. But uh all in all, not too bad. Looks a lot better than that stupid sticker. Hope you enjoy the video. Let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.